Oh, hi. Okay, so I'm tired of saying hi. Okay, let's start. Because it's hard to animate, and I don't like it, okay? So, hey everyone. Today I'll be talking about cross-dressing. Now, this isn't a hate video or something. This is how I love it, what it is, and my experiences. Now, let's begin. First of all, how I love it. Cross-dressing can be from wearing boy-like clothing to full-out drag transformations. I love cross-dressing because it makes me feel like me. I also like cross-dressing because of how inclusive it is. Anyone could do it. Some people will never leave the girls' or boys' section when shopping at Target or something, but I like shopping like there's no signs. Take from Freddie Mercury and Bohemian Rhapsody. Wonder how our world would be if those signs of boys and girls never existed. Sure, most clothes are built for girls and boys, but I wear boy pants and jeans because I have way bigger pockets than these fake pockets. Anyway, what is cross-dressing? Cross-dressing is when someone wants to dress up as the stereotype of the opposite sex. Cross-dressing has been around ever since the Egyptian times, and this female leader who wanted to wear men clothes as a pharaoh to show that it didn't matter on what she wore, but that she was a pharaoh. I learned that in social studies. Cross-dressing can be used in many ways. Expressing oneself, transitioning, performing, and many more. I do it to be me. Now, my experiences. All through my life, I shopped in the girls' section. I was hard to hate the new trends like mermaids and unicorns and sequins and pink. So there was a Target, and I was like, what do they have on the boys' side? So I walked over and got this blue jacket with a bunch of distress, and I still wear it to this day. And ever since then, I've been shopping on the girls' and boys' sections. I mean, you get more clothes, too. I like wearing button-ups and baggy pants that I can pull up really high and make a high-waisted pair of pants because I... I, um... I don't have... I was at a restaurant getting my drink, and this was before I cut my hair, so I kind of look like a girl, and also I was wearing a hat and a hood over my head. Anyway, I was trying to find the lids for my cup, when all of a sudden a woman beside me said, They're over here, buddy. Buddy equals boy. So did she think I'm a boy? That kind of made me happy for some reason, being called a boy. Anyway, what have you guys learned? You'll learn about cross-dressing, and how it's okay to be whatever you want, and that I like looking like a boy. Anyway, bye! Hey guys, this is like the 30th time I've been doing this voiceover because I, first of all, I was like, I'm talking way too fast, and I was like, I I can't talk because all of a sudden, like, you could hear like the smack in the back of my mouth, and right now my cat is on my desk, sorry. So, I had to do this over and over again, but right now I'm in my closet with my headphones on, and the door kind of closed, but it can't close because there's a cord for all the lights in here. If you saw my closet transformation, you'd know that there's lights in here, and there's a cord, and there's no plug in here, so you're going to have to, like, there's an extension cord. It's a whole bunch of, it's a mess, but the door is also closed, so it's pretty good in here. I listened to the recording. I love it. Finally, I don't hate my voice, and yeah. So what's happened? Um, I took a break. If you didn't notice, I didn't post anything except for my blue christmas video which you guys really liked um thank you for all the support and um uh yeah so i post i took a break because i wanted to spend christmas and new year's with my family instead of working on videos but of course i got a stylist for christmas and that stylist literally i that's why i changed my style because of that stylist like i drew that style i remember i drew that first clip like that galaxy thing for the joke but then i just went with it and i forgot to change it and then all of a sudden i'm like hey this looks actually kind of good so i'm still wearing i'm still gonna do those oval eyes because that's where i kind of got my inspiration from but mainly they're just gonna be circles anyway um yeah i don't really know what else to say nothing else has really happened happy new year's merry christmas sorry i didn't get to say that um, 